I want chicken for days! Uh -huh. Warning, this video will make you crave fried chicken, chicken nuggets, chicken sandwiches, and chicken wings. These fast food chains offer an array of chicken menu items that customers love, from mild to spicy and beyond. Chicken is a big hit with all us fast food fans, so here are our 10 best chicken chains in the world. Enjoy. So you kid don't know how lucky you have it. All my life, we only had 11 herbs and spices. El Pollo Loco is worth a visit. Chicken fans flock to El Pollo Loco, where they may indulge in fire-grilled chicken with true Mexican flavor. This fast food chain serves chicken in the Sinaloa, Mexico style and offers an array of tempting menu items, including two, three, and four-piece meals, tostadas, burritos, and bowls. Customers who want lighter fare will be pleased to know that El Pollo Loco offers some lower-calorie menu items. That polo is loco. <laughs> Grab it El Pollo Loco is renowned for its enticing taste. Chicken is fresh rather than frozen, and salsas are whipped up from scratch every day. Each restaurant's team chops up more than 350 fresh tomatoes per day to make El Pollo Loco salsa. The company name means the crazy chicken. and the company has a wacky and cute El Pollo Loco chicken mascot. When this charming mascot appears, he causes a commotion and puts a smile on everyone's face. The El Pollo Loco brand actually represents a couple of independent restaurant chains, which are owned by different firms. There is an American-based El Pollo Loco, as well as an El Pollo Loco in Mexico. Both chains offer the same style of food, but may have different menu items. The very first El Pollo Loco opened in Guasave, Sinaloa during the 70s. In 1980, the chain made its way to the USA. I've never had tacos before. So you've never had tacos? Bojangles offers yummy menu items. Bojangles' famous chicken and biscuits is a popular fast food chain that offers a wide variety of tasty menu items, including Cajun filet sandwiches, tailgate specials, biscuits, chicken rice bowls, and roasted chicken bites. Like a young Bo Derek stuffed with a berry gold water. The restaurant chain was founded in 1977, and it's an American company that offers fried chicken, Cajun seasonings, and biscuits made with fresh buttermilk. This chain mostly serves the southeastern part of America. The first Bojangles opened for business in Charlotte, North Carolina. North Carolina, what a hell of a state. There are now more than 700 Bojangles eateries in the states. Renowned for homey, down-to-earth decor, fast service, and fun, bright yellow packaging, Bojangles really delivers on flavor. Delicious sides such as dirty rice, seasoned fries, grits, macaroni and cheese, and Cajun pintos are perfect fixings. The biscuits set this fried chicken chain apart from the competition. If you're a biscuit fan and you haven't tried Bojangles, you may want to put this fast food chain on your bucket list. You have a bucket list? Zaxby's has a big following. I got the most followers because I give the people what they want. Zaxby's is known for chicken wings and chicken fingers, and there are more than 600 Zaxby's eateries. This restaurant chain operates mostly in the southeastern part of the USA, so some Americans have trouble getting their hands on fast food fare from Zaxby's, such as the Zensation Filet Sandwich, Buffalo Chicken Fingers, the Blue Salad, and Boneless Wings and Things. This fast food chain is newer than many, as its first eatery opened for business during March of 1990. How are we getting home? This is home. At present, the company has restaurants in 18 American states. Chicken and sauce recipes utilized at Zaxby's are based on recipes from another chicken restaurant chain. The chain was known as Guthrie's, and it was smaller than Zaxby's. Zaxby's is renowned for its dipping sauces, which are offered along with orders of chicken fingers. Dipping sauces range from mild to medium to super hot. The Zax sauce is moderately hot. Those who adore really spicy sauce should request nuclear or insane sauce. I'm a, I'm a cat. I'm a sexy cat. Mickey D's Chicken McNuggets are a hit. McDonald's is offering tender, crispy chicken McNuggets and a new Szechuan sauce. Sure, McDonald's isn't all about chicken, but it's safe to say that its McNuggets are a huge hit. 
Plus, the mammoth fast food chain offers McChicken sandwiches and other chicken menu items. Chicken McNuggets appeal to a lot of different age groups, and they've been hugely popular since they were introduced. I sure am hungry for my favorite food. McNugget. Most of us have dipped chicken McNuggets in our preferred sauces, such as honey mustard sauce or tangy barbecue sauce. And it's delicious. Maybe we've even enjoyed them plain. Some of us prefer other chicken-based McDonald's menu items, such as buttermilk crispy chicken sandwiches, Southwest grilled chicken salads, and spicy barbecue glazed tenders. McDonald's menus change sometimes, as all fast food menus do, but the McChicken sandwich and Chicken McNuggets are always on the menu. These chicken dishes always have a loyal client base. Wingstop is impressing customers. Wingstop is another chicken fast food chain that's reasonably new. It was founded in 1994 in Addison, Texas. These restaurants have fun aviation themes that bring a sense of nostalgia. What image? Sky captain of yesteryear. This chain specializes in chicken wings. Individual wing combo meals are available in three sizes, including six wing, eight wing, and 10 wing. And there are also three piece and five piece crispy tender combos. Customers also get to choose one dip for their wings with each combo order. Individual combos aren't the only thing on the menu at Wingstop. There are also specials, wings by the piece, and group packs. Boy, some chicken wings would really hit the spot. And a selection of typical fast food beverages. There are also lots of fun and delicious sides, including the popular Louisiana voodoo fries and Cajun fried corn. In terms of dips, there are great choices, such as honey mustard and homemade ranch. This restaurant is a place for wings. Jollibee gets high marks. I hate mascots. You know they fart in those suits. In the Philippines, Jollibee is the biggest fast food chain of all. There are more than 1,150 Jollibee locations there. The chain decided to expand, and that's why Americans can enjoy Jollibee now. The company has also expanded into Canada and the UK, plus lots of other world destinations. The company is known for its adorable bee mascot, as well as its fried chicken, which is crispy on the outside and nice and juicy on the inside. This chain didn't get to be a powerhouse in the Philippines and worldwide for no reason. Fried chicken from this fast food chain tastes great. Buckets of chicken are available and so are individual combos. One fun fact about Jollibee's is that some of their individual combos come with fried chicken plus spaghetti on the side. It's like a big pile of spaghetti. For Americans, this is a unique spin on the typical fried chicken combo meal. Chicken dippers, chicken sandwiches, burgers, and burger steaks are also on the menu. Overall, Jollibee's provides a bit of welcome novelty to USA customers, plus great taste. You'll find Jollibee's in San Jose, Jacksonville, Irvine, and other USA cities. If you don't have a Jollibee's nearby, you may want to visit one while you're traveling. Ah, I hate myself. Church's chicken is so tasty. This beloved fast food chain is all American although it's now expanded into other countries, including Canada. It opened for business back in 1952. It's a Texas-based company that launched in San Antonio. In North America, it's known as Church's Chicken. Outside of North America, it's called Texas Chicken. At first, the eatery offered chicken only, but it eventually added other menu items, including jalapenos and french fries. By 1956, when its founder sadly passed away, there were a handful of the restaurants. Now, it's a big chain. You just brought a bucket of chicken to church. Thanks to major expansion, this fast food chain became the second biggest chicken chain by the end of the 80s. At that time, it merged with another chicken chain called Popeyes. The merger meant that the supply lines were merged, but the chains were still marketed individually under their own names. So what's cooking at churches? Well, tender strip meals and mixed combos are on the menu in original or spicy formulations. There are also family meals that come with 10, 15, or 20 pieces of chicken. Getting hungry yet? This is the type of fare that fried chicken fans really crave. It was so delicious, but... 
it wasn't fried chicken. Popeye's Louisiana Kitchen is very popular. Makes you strong like Popeye. Have you heard about the big Popeye's chicken sandwich craze? It's sweeping the nation and causing such a ruckus. This sandwich craze points to the epic popularity of Popeye's Louisiana Kitchen, which was founded in Louisiana, but now has headquarters in Miami. Popeye's offers classic Southern food, including fried chicken, but its new chicken sandwich is currently getting almost all of the press. So what's up with this sandwich anyway? Well, this sandwich, which is formerly known as the Popeye's Chicken Sandwich, went on sale at almost all of its American restaurants during August of 2019. By the end of August, Popeye's management announced that it was totally sold out and that time would be needed to replenish stock. Popeye's VIPs suspected the sandwich would be a hit, but didn't understand just how powerful the allure of this chicken sandwich really was. Served on a brioche bun, the sandwich featured chicken in buttermilk batter topped with mayo and pickles. It does sound good, doesn't it? What's not to like? Fans of the sandwich started to get antsy when it wasn't available. Some felt that upper management at Popeyes was playing mind games by denying them the sandwich that they loved. Diplo managed to get bags of the forbidden sandwiches, which he flaunted while exiting his private jet. This sounds like a Diplo song! For those without fame, the sandwiches remain elusive. But it has since been put back on the menu after management made some changes. And let's hope these changes make it so that everyone can get a bite. Yeah, it is kind of weird. Chick-fil-A gets rave reviews. I just want to go out and pick up some younger chicks, and I need a wingman for that. This restaurant chain was founded by S. Truett Cathy. It's the third biggest USA fast food chain and the biggest in terms of specializing in chicken sandwiches. Chick-fil-A HQ is located in College Park, Georgia. The founder of this chain was a Southern Baptist who was devout. The chain upholds his values. For example, you can't visit this restaurant on Sundays because it's closed. And it's it's not open on Christmas or Thanksgiving either. Its mission statement includes Bible verses. That spirit is sancti, etc. The chain offers an array of chicken sandwiches. Some are more basic and some are deluxe. Some feature fried fillets and others feature grilled chicken. There are also grilled or fried nuggets, plus chicken strips, salads, and sides. Chick-fil-A has some interesting sides, including potato waffle fries, chicken noodle soup, chicken tortilla soup, and a superfood side that features some healthy greens. Eight dipping sauces are on the menu, including a Polynesian sauce and the classic Chick-fil-A sauce. There is one sauce that's designed just for the grilled chicken. The recipe for the first Chick-fil-A chicken sandwich was invented back in 1964 by the chain's founder, who is no longer with us. At the time, his invention of a boneless and breaded filet on buttered buns was considered very innovative. We are gonna be the best thing since sliced bread. KFC is so addictive. Somebody said you could help me. I have to. I haven't had KFC in almost a week. KFC chicken is so good. Maybe it's the seasoning, huh? That legendary blend of herbs and spices is just so addictive. KFC is selling a meatless version of its fried chicken in Atlanta as a test. It's called Beyond KFC. And it is probably awesome, as long as it has that seasoning that's so irresistible. However, a lot of people are going to continue ordering the chicken because they crave the stuff. While the meatless thing is huge right now and may keep growing, there are still carnivores out there who want fried chicken and other meat-based dishes. Time will tell how the meatless experiment goes. We taught a lion to eat tofu. The meatless faux fried chicken is called Beyond Fried Chicken. It's an interesting idea. Some who got to try it weren't blown away. Others may find that it's just what they've been waiting for. KFC was founded by the late Colonel Sanders, who was always so immaculate in his white suits. After Mickey D's, it's the biggest fast food chain there is. There are over 22,500 KFC locations in 136 nations. KFC delivers for customers. They keep coming back to get buckets of fried chicken, chicken sandwiches, fries, coleslaw, and so much more. Big box and fill-up meals are popular choices. Mm, I'm gonna get some chicken. I can't wait. We've got more than chicken on our menu, so stick around and tap on one of our other great videos. First time here? Then show us some love and tap that subscribe button and that bell to join our notification squad.